It's like, you know those jalapenos, you get them and some are fine and then you bite the next one and it's a total face melter. I like that Russian roulette effect of the jalapeno. I don't know if I'm so cool with the scotch bonnet. This is like nuclear reaction. Yes, it, like it's an angry little pepper. Hi, I'm Sam Corbet, brewmaster and co-founder here at the Sawdust City Brewing Company, and today we're going to eat some scotch bonnet peppers. Okay. I'm gonna try to swallow and not chew. I'm gonna see if that helps. Wow, it's hot. It tastes really good. How do you like your coffee? Black. Uh, regular. One cream, one sugar. <coughs> My lips really hot. Um, a vice beer, actually. I have a vice. Yeah. I think Baltic Porter, something I I really like. It's sort of like a sister of an imperial stout, very full of flavor, and it's something that in the future I'd like to try. Uh, my favorite uh, Sawdust City beer is Electric Storm. Wow, I'm crying. Oh my god, look at that sweat. Uh, I had Lone Pine. And it was in Toronto. And this was sort of my first introduction to IPAs. It was the Dunkel. I was sitting right there, just at the end of the uh, table there. I think I'd have to say my daughter or my wife. My daughter has been dealing with a type 1 diabetic since she's age of four. And she's been a really strong with it and it never really affected her life. Let's see Bernie Sanders. <clears throat> I think probably I would have to go with my grandmother. Uh, she's just a very kind-hearted person, uh, always help, uh, willing to help people out, uh, give advice to anyone that needs it. you feel the burn right now? I feel the burn. Yes. Not like just during it, but right beforehand I uh, started doing a little bit of drawing and digital art. Actually, I picked up uh, the guitar. Oh, and uh, Spanish. Yeah, I really, uh, really took to making pizza. I got myself a pizza oven. Learned to make pizza dough, I've been doing that a lot. I think it'll be balanced pretty well. I think there will be that underlying heat. Subtle hints of the pineapple kind of come through. You do get the aroma from the scotch bonnet and a little bit of the flavor as well, but it's not like overbearing. So it'll hit you with the this, this sour at first and then the sweetness of the pineapple and hopefully the finish will be the pepper, a little bit of heat. I think you'll notice it, but it's not going to be overbearing. Pineapple and Scotch Bonnet Kettle Sour will be available at Sada City on June 23rd. Thank you very much. Very well, all right. It's not bad. It was bad for the first, well, it's still bad.